Hey guys, what's going on? It's Crystal Collects and I'm back with another EV Heroes unboxing, but in this video I'll be featuring two VMAX special sets. Now this includes eight booster packs of EV Heroes along with one VMAX special pack, which will include three reverse hollow energies and also one out of four possible Evolution VMAX cards. Now keep in mind these VMAX cards are exclusive only to these VMAX special sets, you cannot pull them from EV Heroes. And this includes the Vaporeon, the Jolteon, the Flareon, and the Espeon. Now the ones that I'm particularly after have to include the Espeon and the Vaporeon. Jay's Chase Evolution is actually Flareon. So now hopefully we'll pull any of these Evolutions in this opening. Again, I'm opening two because I do not know what the pull rates are like. Hopefully we're lucky enough to pull an alternative artwork. So before we get started, please make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more to language Pokemon, Beyblade, and Mazika Party content. Let's get going. All right, so before we get into the opening, I'm going to show you guys the specs for the actual box first. So as you can see on the top, we have the four V Maxes that are exclusive to this set. And on the back, here are other Evolutions you can also pull from the actual set, EV here. But of course, as mentioned, I'll be opening two, and without further ado, I'm actually going to take out the packs first, so there's less fluffing about, so be right back with you all. Alright, so all the packs are out, and of course, we're going to start with one VMAX, and I'll save the other VMAX for last, just to keep it interesting. But let's see what we pull in the first one. Also going to give the pack a good shake, I do not want to cut into the cards. Very pretty pack, by the way, so very similar to the other kind of special VMAX set. <gasps> and look at that, we got my favorite, we got Vaporeon, so that's one of the two chases. This is number two out of the four possible VMAXs, and also, we have here reverse hollow energy card so this is really a nice addition and i'll go ahead and sleeve up my lovely vaporan so just to also give you guys another look at the lovely texture so very happy with that starting off strong already so i'll put that on pile number one and now onto our eight booster packs of EV heroes let's see if we can pull any alternate arts and also any missing evolutions that i have not pulled yet and as mentioned before in the previous video we have the puzzle cards with a lot of different graphics on them so one to the front is the card trick and ooh, we look at who it is it's my favorite second evolution we have marsh tom and we have here meowth really cute indeedy Makia in one pack as well and holographic marsh taunt that would have been so cool if it was swamp bird because it's my favorite evolution line from the hoenn region would have been in one pack but it's okay also one thing to note these packs feel a little bit jet puffed and also let's see if we can pull jay's chase evolution right jay yep. the one that looks like a naruto character you said karama i believe flareon Yo, there you go flareon yeah flareon <laughs> all right we have smeargle oh nice smeargle artwork azumarill and the sun and moon badge it's actually a badge not a charm but there's a lot of them in the set and i like how some of them combine the evolution types which is really cool especially the elemental one the one that combines the vaporeon no, vaporeon flareon and also jolteon types together so one to the front all right we have the floet we have the araquanid pikachu this is a really cute pikachu card by the way from this set mawal in psychic type and then the ribbon badge helping out sylveon since it's a fairy type all right next pack another jet puff pack a really great set in my opinion lots of nice cards and also lots of returning pokemon we haven't seen for quite a while especially the swampert i'm a big fan of that because i love water type pokemon and especially the starters mudkip was with me for quite some time we have my latic we have mawile we have slugma lots of gen 3 pokemon pikachu oh nice a vmax i actually don't have wow these vmax boxes are definitely treating me very well we have number 26 out of 69 glaceon again only pullable from ev heroes not from the vmax pack pretty good so far and also a lovely pikachu as well all right hopefully i think i'm still missing flareon v and also umbreon v as well so let's see let's see if we can pull any of those and i think maybe leafy on v as well but yeah, i'm trying to collect all the evolutions so we have floet we have little worm there we have slugma tynamo wow another v card wow lots of pulls i'm very surprised at the pull rates of this sylveon v my first duplicate but very adorable card and also in the psychic typing not the fairy typing that's actually very different <laughs> but of course in the sword and shield era they've taken away taken away fairy types which i'm a little bit sad about but that and also the dragon types imagine if there was a dragon type evolution what would it look like just going to show you guys the puzzle cards still have to figure out what this all means together oh we have the elemental trio which is very nice the elemental badge with the trio of the first generation evolutions okay we got some of uh, voltorb and marsh time it looks so happy just chilling in the puddle is that even a puddle it looks like a pool actually <laughs> all right second to last pack from the first v max set and then we're on to v max set number two quite rewarding opening actually especially since we got one of our favorite one of my favorite actually uh, v evolutions so far okay one to the front 
so far pretty generous pulls not too many empty packs which is great and i think we have a hollow in this one from what i see in the back we have rotom again not gonna expect any secret rares oh we have swamp right okay i was actually hoping to pull another one of these because these are so nice i'm not gonna expect any secret rares i'd say maybe every other v max set but if you're really lucky there there could be no secret rares in this video but we'll see we'll have to just open all the packs to find out shall we all right, so one to the front here, but I'm happy to at least pull one of my Chase V Maxes. So let's keep going here. Last pack from the first V Max set, and then we're on to pile number two. Another Pikachu, Pangoro, and then this trainer card. All right, so now I'm gonna leave this to last, like I said, because I want to keep things interesting. We're gonna go straight to the packs of the second V Max set, and then we'll do the big reveal at the end what the second V Max is. It's either hopefully gonna be Jay's Chase card or my Chase card with Espeon. Okay, so we have a puzzle card there, and then one to the front. So let's get going here. We have the fairy looking mall. We have another Indeedee female form, I believe. We have lovely Phoebus, Rotom, and a pincer with the Ichigeki logo. Very fierce pincer. Would not want to mess with that one. On to the next pack here. Again, jet puffed, similar to the first set, but I'm very happy with how the box all came so clean in transit from Japan. One to the front here. All right. So let's see. Oh, we have our trainer. We have Gordy from Sir Chester. Again, if, depending whether you play Sword and Shield, you're going to have two different gym leaders. Melanie was in Shield. Gordy was in Sword. And we have here Marshadow. Shout out to my friend Eliza and Josh because they love Marshadow. Really cute legendary, actually. I love how it does like multiple punches. All right, next pack here. Actually, really fun set to open, honestly, especially it grants you those nice VMAX evolutions. And especially since it's exclusive to this, definitely worth opening in my opinion. Okay, we have here Electrode, we have Dewpider, Mantine, really cute with the Remoraid. Okay, we have Flabebe, and we have Palosand, okay. I'd say the other box seemed a little bit more generous, but I could be wrong. Let's see what the last few packs have to say. What was interesting too was in the other um, box we had like two Vs in a row, which was really cool. Puzzle card. It looks, it looks like a lot of like game mechanic stuff. Okay, we have here an energy card. Lovely Eevee, just regular Eevee with the really nice silver borders, Voltorb, Dewpider, and Marsh Tom. Oh, interesting. Not too many pulls, unless the last few packs are going to surprise me. <laughs> what do you think, Jay? I have no idea. We'll see. No idea. And I'll be very happy though. Yeah, I haven't actually pulled any Flareons yet, so none of Jay's Chase Evolution yet. No secret rares. No secret rares yet. Again, not guaranteed, but if you're lucky to pull one feel blessed because they do not come up often with these i'm sure it's also very interesting because this vmax set oh we have floor dress very nice holographic this vmax set is the first to have all the packs from saint from the same one set the previous one had one booster pack from eight different sets so that was very interesting again no guaranteed good pulls but at least with this one you have a lot of um unity in terms of the type of sets you have just one set okay we have a trainer card here we have araquanid pikachu this is definitely not a generous box but it is what it is unless it grants me a secret rare at the very end that's when it would be very worthwhile but that's also why i chose to open two boxes just to give you guys a better idea of how the pull rates are like so all right so what we have here in this pack flip it to do just so you guys can see the puzzle cards get a better look at them okay we have floet we have Meryl, really adorable card of Meryl there. And I think we have something in the back here. And, oh yes, yes. Okay, this is definitely worthwhile though. Now that we got my favorite Umbreon, this is number 47 out of 69. That looks really, really, really cool on the um, dark borders as well. It matches the black borders of typical V cards. So there we go. One pull from that box and we have our last pack and then the V Max pack. So if it is an Espeon, I'll still say it's worthwhile because that is one of my favorite evolutions. All right, here we go. Other than that, just a few hollows, which is not too bad. One to the front here. All right, we have here, I'm not gonna expect too much from this one. We have Electrode, we have Slugma, we have Sandy Guest, Mantine, and okay. We just have a ribbon badge, but, but, I saved the best for last. I saved the last V Max pack. All right, let's see what we got in here. See what you do. I like the appearance of these packs though. They're really, really pretty. All righty, so. We're gonna, I think it's on the front, so I'm just gonna flip it and <gasps> we got Jay's Chase Evolution. We got Flareon. How happy are you? Very happy. Number one out of four. So that's the first. And of course we have here uh, three reverse hollow fire energies, which is very, very nice. Wow. Congratulations. The good thing is we definitely got some varieties. And here you guys get another look at lovely Flareon and then we'll do our final review. So I'll be right back with you guys. 
All right, so time for our final review. So sadly, no secret rares, but I'll definitely show you guys what we got. Very happy with the pulls overall, but of course, gonna show you the hollows as well. So this is from 16 booster packs plus the two VMAX packs. So a couple of Mars Shadows and my favorite, we got Swampert as well. So onto the V cards. We have Sylveon V. Happy to get this Umbreon. Just love, love getting evolutions I haven't gotten yet. We got Glaceon VMAX. We got Vaporeon VMAX. So this is from the VMAX pack, as mentioned earlier, and also Flareon. So we got a chase card for Jay and a chase card for me. So out of two VMAX sets, we got five lovely pulls and a few hollows as well. So I hope you found this opening fun and also informative. If you did so, please make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more multi-language Pokemon, Beyblade, and Mazika Party content. Stay safe, everyone. We'll see you in the next video.